Hey, in this video, I'm going to give you my honest physical therapist review of the ACE runner's knee strap. This is a strap that goes around your knee and it's marketed as use with runners, people that are running or that are in running sports. And it's just a simple strap. You can see it right here. There's, that's all that's in the box, by the way. There's no other instructions. It's a pretty straightforward device. You just strap it onto your knee. Now there is a special part that goes on the knee. Let me just show you up close here. It's got this Velcro it sticks very well because it's going to be it's intended to be used when you're running and on the inside here it's got this bone shaped pad and it's it's firm but it's cushiony it's got some give to it and on this pad you put that on your knee below your kneecaps your kneecap would go up here and then there's a tendon that runs down below the, re the kneecap and that's where this would put some pressure and this will wrap around the, the tendon as well to give it some compression. So the way that you use this is you put it on this way. So there's my kneecap right there. There's the tendon that runs right below. Here's the bone where it connects to. That goes right over the tendon below the kneecap. Then you strap on the strap. Make sure that it is snug just like so and it's giving you some mild compression here you could tighten it a bit more of course it just shouldn't it should not cut off your circulation when you have this on it should be firm but not too firm and the idea here is that it's compressing the area and offering it some pain relief now the research behind this is very poor there isn't really good research um, that doesn't mean that it doesn't work I've had people come in that have gotten by through races when they do this because I, I'm a runner myself. I, I, I don't run a whole lot like I used to back in the day. My schedule with children does not allow me to run like I used to or like I want to. I used to be running 10, 20, sometimes 30 miles in a week. Um, now I'm lucky if I can get in a good five or six miles a week. But um, I used to suffer from runner's knee back when I was in high school and I did use one of these straps and I found it to be effective to get me through my cross country season and track season one school year. The nice thing about this brace is it's not a big brace that you slide on like a sleeve. So it's a lot easier to run with something like this on. Um, if you're in other running sports like basketball, soccer, this can also be worn during those activities. Now I can tell you from experience, my knee pain got worse over the, the time, but I kept training harder and harder as I was dealing with this throughout my high school years. I ended up solving the knee problem. It was a muscle imbalance, which I talk a lot about on this channel. Um, I had to work out some other muscles to solve the excessive pressure that was going through my tendon here. But this thing got me through an entire cross country season in the, in the fall and then a track season in the spring. So I definitely can vouch for devices like this. It just puts that pressure on there and adds compression and it gives you a different sensation to the area. And as long as you're doing something to fix a root problem, this can be a tool that can allow you to avoid having to rely on pain medications or going to the doctor for injections um, and allow you to get through a run. But it is advisable to go fix your muscle imbalances. Go find the root problem, which this is not treating. This is just giving you a temporary short-term relief, but it's not fixing the root problem. Now, these are designed to be worn on either side, so you could just take it off and make sure the, the little bone shaped deal is on the other kneecap thread it through let me show you what it looks like you just thread it through the little hook here and it's ready to strap bring the strap over and you're good to go that's going to stay on very well now i can bend my knees pretty good did slip off just a bit there we go there's a little bone, wishbone. I can squat and do whatever I want. This stays in place much better than some of the other braces. So to give you my honest physical therapist review about this, um, it's a good tool. I like it in people that are very active, especially runners, because you get that pain under the kneecap, which is associated with patellofemoral pain syndrome. Um, and it's an overuse of the tendon. It's a tendonitis, essentially, of the, the patellar tendon. Um, there's other causes of patellofemoral pain syndrome. Patellofemoral pain syndrome a syndrome is a variety of symptoms and, and signs and symptoms that come together to make the problem. 
It could be your cartilage behind the kneecap. It could be the tendon below the kneecap as well. Um, but if you specifically have pain in that tendon right there, this is a good tool to use. So I definitely would say go ahead and grab one of these. They're super cheap. I picked this one up from Amazon. You can get them at your um, uh, drug stores. These are pretty available everywhere. Walmart, Target will have these. Uh, sporting goods stores like Dick's. Um, we have academies here. Uh, I'm sure you could find the sporting goods store next to you and easily pick one of these up or order one off Amazon, which we've provided a link for you to order these off Amazon down in the description below. If this is the first time you're meeting me here, my name is Dr. David Midoff and I'm a specialist physical therapist at El Paso Manual Physical Therapy. And on this channel, we specialize in helping people stay healthy, active, and mobile while avoiding unnecessary surgery, injections, and medications. We make helpful videos with advice, tips, exercises, and stretches for a variety of problems. In the description of this video, you can find a link to our playlist section where we've got a bunch of playlists that have videos targeted at helping specific problems. Uh, I'll link specifically patellofemoral pain syndrome or, or kneecap pain um, because we've got a good amount of videos to help with that. And this tool can help you get through that problem much easier. Thanks for watching and I hope to catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.